Alright, what's good everyone? So we just got our first Blood Python clutch of the season. This is gonna be um a T neck golden eye bred to this weird ivory girl. And she just finished laying not too long ago, so let's see what she has in there. She feels empty, so so it looks like she buried some of her eggs. There goes a slug there. So let's see. So total one, two, three, four, five slugs. Put it right here. Pushed any more eggs under the arm. See if she pushed any more eggs under the bedding. So, boom. 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 Make sure. All right, nothing else. So, let's see if these eggs are good. So that's good, 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 good. Good, 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 good. This one, maybe not, this one might not be good. This one looks good. So, total of one, two, three, four, five. 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. So, all right, so 14 eggs. Keep watching. I'll show the arm um, cutting and then the babies. All right, so a few of the babies already started pipping. It looks like we lost uh, three eggs during incubation. But the rest seem to be good. So I'm going to start with this one right here. Let's see. Definitely looks like a uh, double seven in there. This one right here has a couple cuts in it too. Let's see. Looks like a matrix. <clears throat> Another double seven in there. Nice little double seven. So those were all the eggs that pipped on their own. Now we'll try some of these. Let me see. All right, that's a double seven in there. That was hard to see. <laughs> I 
Looks like a matrix. I think this egg's bad. You can see mold already on it. I don't know if the baby in there is going to be good or not. It looks like a matrix in that one. And then for the last one. I think it's a double seven, really dirty looking one. But we'll wait for them to come out and I'll show them. All right, so here's all the babies. Unfortunately, we did lose two in the egg. It was uh, one was a matrix, another one was a double seven. The rest of these look pretty fine though. Some of these matrixes didn't um, absorb that well. The yolk, they seem to be doing okay. Not sure if this clutch is going to prove out anything with um, the mother having any additional genes going on with how dark she is. But uh, I would say this one right here might be something going on. Let me see. Yeah, you see how dark and dirty the neck is? Very similar to the Ivory Mom. The matrixes in here are a lot harder to tell since they're pretty dark. But usually double sevens aren't this dirty looking throughout the neck area so there you go she's really dirty looking really dark this one over here is a little dark too in the neck area but what do we got we got four matrixes in here and four double seven so not bad at all. And these guys are all going to try to start getting away now. Alright, so. The double sevens. This one right here is really nice too with this two stripe look to it. This one's about to fall. Definitely has a unique look to it right there, this one, versus the rest. Really active, gonna try to get out. So I'm gonna go sex these, set them up. Not gonna try to mess with them too much. Stay inside, come on. That's about all I got for y'all on this clutch. Y'all already know what it is. Hate, comment, subscribe. Next time. Later.